Hi there, I'm Claire Balding and I have written a childhood memoir called My Animals and Other Family. It's taken the Gerald Durrell title and with permission of his widow flipped it around and there is a very good reason for that because every chapter focuses on a different animal. I grew up in a rather unusual household. My father was champion racehorse trainer, so I was surrounded by a hundred thoroughbreds, by mares and foals, by a pack of boxers and lurchers. And to be perfectly honest, my brother Andrew and I came pretty near the bottom of the pecking order. For most of my childhood, I actually thought I was a dog. I liked to wear a collar around my head and I liked to drink from the dog's bowl. And frankly, I don't see what's wrong with that. But I think also I aged in dog years, so I reached an emotional maturity by the age of 10, I knew what it was like to feel jealousy, to feel the pain of loss, unbearable loss when an animal dies. I knew what it felt like to love, really passionately love something, because I adored the dogs and I adored the ponies. Frank, for example, I mean, Frank, he was the only one who really understood me. And the sad thing is I still think that to this day, I genuinely do. But it was a magical childhood as well. We grew up right next to Wardship Down on the Hampshire Downs. So we had this fantastic landscape around us and we went off to have all sorts of adventures on horseback. And this is the story of that childhood. It takes me right up to the age of 19, by which time I was riding in races and I was trying to get into Cambridge University. And there's that struggle as well. But most of all, I think it is the story of the animals. It's their story as much as it is mine.